As time has technology developed, and now global social media users have reached to 3.6 billion, which is about 51% of the global population. Back in 2005, there's only about 5% of users in the United States were involved in social media. And then you will wonder, why is social media so important? Humans never used the internet for the past 5,000 years. And some people like my grandpa think that internet is something to be thrown away because it's posted in children's mind. Without the life without social media, people can still have a wonderful life. So here comes the question. Is social media changing our world and human life? The answer to this question is yes. So today I will be mainly discuss how will social media impact our society in the future. The founder of Boeing has a famous text about the succeed of 7 for 7. The 7 for 7 will be a great weapon for peace, competing with intercontinental missile for mankind's destiny. So the reason why Trump says this is because he foresaw how the plane is going to help decongest for overcrowded airports and bring down the cost of flying, also opening up air travel to the middle class. And when Trip's first airline put in the first order of 747, he boards how the plane will become a great weapon for peace because it's connecting the world and bring people together. So the plane is connecting the world in the past, and now we have something even better, and that is social media. TikTok as an example, on August 2, 2019, the social app has been all spread along the road. The most special thing about this app is a short form video sharing that allows users to create 15 seconds video on any topic. And many people use TikTok to introduce or spread their knowledge through social media platforms. And this plays an important role to different countries and different cultural backgrounds because they can share their ideas and more ideas will be combined together. Personally, because I have been watching TikTok for a long time, to me, TikTok can be an entertainment social app, but however, it can also be a learning or training material. It can teach you many different life hacks, and I enjoy watching those videos. Another special thing about TikTok is the algorithm, which teach, teaches, teach, and learns about the user's content and of uh, interest specifically, and it's faster than any other apps. After all, we all saw that the content spread within TikTok is far reaching. All it takes for an individual is to like a video or watch an entire of it for the video to spread. Still, there are many types of social media, and TikTok is only but one part of them. It has connected people in a closer way and has a big benefit to individual people and broader society. As we can see now, social media has increasingly changed our world compared to before. But how will it impact the future? And how will social media be like in the future? Imagine social media can be a moving bank. You are able to pay your rent or make an investment through your favorite social media networks. Social media can also be a business strategy. Imagine digital marketing or new customer service communication channels. Or social media can also be a shaping up health kit. It helps to put in groups that are suffering from the same conditions and through online services. No matter what, social media, what role social media will play on, one thing that will admit that is social media is changing as time passes and is making our life more easier and more interesting. However, in the future, as social media is more widely used, it will have a positive impact to the whole society. For example, people can work together to figure out the scientific problem and increasing working efficiency and investing what we really need. Or on education side, students can research on the website and get information more faster. Also, thoughts will be contradict to each other and will 
and then we'll pass more new opinions. So therefore, the gap between individual people, traditional cultures, and special religions is getting smaller and smaller. So as we can see, it, social media has connected with each other, and it can let us move towards a better world. Even though social media has brought us so much benefits, the problem is not everyone on the earth can get this benefit. There are still 2, 2 million and 900 million people, which is 37% of the global population that, that cannot access to social media. And there are many pieces of components to this problem. First one, it can be digital gender gap, which is a, a globally impacted there are 62% of users for men, and the proportion of women is only 57%. And, 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 and in the least developed men countries, there is only 31% of the users for men, and 19% of the users for women. So we can see the gender difference between people is a very big issue. Another reason it can be city gap. So city gap it can mean a gap between cities and villages. In high development countries, the users in city was two two times more than in villages. And in less development countries, the users in cities were four times more than the, the users in villages. And the last reason can be is the age gap. There is 71% of the users were 15 to 24 years old. And when all the other ages are together, it's only 57%. So thinking of those gender gap, village and city gap, and age difference. It's such a shame that we do not have the opportunity to show their talent, show their ideas, and show themselves. So this also shows that, that social media does not show their potential power, and not everyone can gain those birds as others does. In conclusion, looking at the back at this moment and in the future, social media has changed our life, but those benefits have not been open to everyone on the planet. We shall hope that we improve in the future, and all human beings can be involved in social media and make it a better place for you and for me. Thank you.